Hi, this is Mr. Weisenfeld. We're talking about PS1, Newton's second law. We're going to walk through this standard, what you need to know, uh, the objective, and then the learning progression, what you need to, be, to know at each level in this standard. So first of all, Newton's second law, can you apply that? Here's the objective. Can you apply Newton's second law to explain how balanced and unbalanced forces affect the motion of objects? In particular, Newton's second law is all about quantifying uh, the forces and the accelerations on an object. So first of all, can you state Newton's second law? Yes, I can. F equals ma. Boom. That's it. Newton's second law, one point, or level 1.0 proficiency in this standard. Then you need to define uh, inertia, balanced forces, unbalanced forces, positive acceleration, negative acceleration, vectors, boundary kind of forces, magnitude versus direction, uh, friction, speed, velocity, distance, acceleration, units of measurements. Wow, that's a lot. Some of that was in uh, PS1, Newton's first law, but that's a lot. Uh, but you need to do that for level one. Uh, 1.0 or uh, basic level proficiency in this standard. Uh, so let's talk about level two. Can you basically calculate the net force using free body diagrams or word problems on an object? So if I'm pulling 5 newtons this way and 10 newtons this way, my net force is this way, 10 newtons. You need to be able to do that. You need to, be, you need to especially be able to do that with a diagram with arrows that are representing directions of forces and with magnitude, so lengths of those arrows that are talking to you about the size of forces. Uh, that's one part of level 2 proficiency. Level 2 proficiency part. Another part, you need to identify and replace missing information uh, given Newton's second law and a free body diagram. So we did the quiz. The quiz, we talked about this a few times, uh, replacing missing information. That's level two. Okay, that was level 2 second uh, level of proficiency in Newton's second law standard. Now uh, level 3, uh, you need to be able to calculate the force given the mass and the acceleration. So you just multiply the two. Uh, that's what it takes for level 3O proficiency in this standard Newton's second law. Then level 4, uh, to do above 3.0 uh, performance on this standard, you need to, given an F and an A, can you give me the M? So divide F by A to give me the mass. And given a force, F and an M mass, can you give me the A? So F divided by M equals A. Uh, you also need to be able to make predictions based on stuff you've collected about uh, uh, systems where Newton's second law can be applied. So that was it. That was a uh, standard uh, PS1 Newton's second law.